October 26, 2010, the National Institutes of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, or NIAID, held a town hall meeting to examine the restructuring of the NIAID Clinical Trials Network. I'm Carl Diefenbach. I'm the director of the Division of AIDS, which is a component of the National Institutes of Allergy and Infectious Diseases at the NIH. For years, there's been a significant amount of clinical research run through clinical trials and networks in the, in the research area of HIV and AIDS. The purpose of today's meeting is to really bring in the community and the interested investigators to comment on our goals of adding additional research capacity to the ongoing HIV AIDS effort in other infectious diseases. This is not to take away from the HIV AIDS effort, but to in many ways to then start bringing in this level of capacity in these other critical infectious diseases. How was the town hall meeting received? We're hearing a lot of support for the approach. I think that there's um, a unanimity in the room that this is a worthwhile exercise, that this is the way to go. They like the directions um, that we're headed in HIV and AIDS. A fair amount of questions have been about, you know, are you going to do, are you really saying what you're saying, that you're going to really tackle in an integrated way hepatitis C, which is a major challenge for both um, HIV infected uh, people and other individuals in the United States. Are you really going to tackle tuberculosis? But also, are we going to really be able to build out um, an infrastructure that can deal with gram-negative sepsis, that can deal with influenza, that can really tackle the diseases that are killing the, the other, other infectious diseases that are killing Americans today?